Hello everyone, Akash here. Do you want to better yourself? We all have different things that we need to work on in order to improve ourselves. Basically, bettering yourself means making the better decision to make a change to help you improve and grow within yourself. Maybe you want to better yourself for other people or maybe you want to be a better friend. Whatever your reason is, let's go through in this video 10 inspiring way to better yourself. So the first tip would be start your day on a right note. Basically, beginning up your day sets up for a good day versus bad day so you want to start your day think about what are the things that are important to you and how that will affect your mood throughout the day you could always make adjustment as needed maybe you could wake up 30 minutes earlier in order to go to gym or meditate 15 to 20 minutes this will definitely set you up with positive mindset and that will help you better to carry out your day tasks. So the second tip would be set boundaries. Setting boundaries will help you better define yourself. What is acceptable behavior? This way you will be able to focus on the things that are important. So you don't get distracted by everything else going on around you. If something happening in your life, don't just give in to it. Just because someone wants or expect otherwise. Set boundaries this way you could focus what's important to you so you can be the best person that you want to be. So the third tip would be stop comparing yourself to others. It's an easy thing to do comparing yourself to others, but it will take a lot away from you and it won't make you happy. Remember, there is only one way to live your life. Accept that for yourself. If someone else has more than you, they may also have more to do and stress about. Or someone has less than you, it will be better for you to focus what makes them happy rather than what's missing in their life. So the fourth tip would be make peace with the past. It's never too late to make peace with your past. Also, you can choose now that it won't define who you are. It is pointless to living in regret. You can still have better future without letting your past dictate who you are. It will be easier for you to move on by forgiving yourself and others who have hurt you and appreciate the things that make up your life. And always remind yourself, be grateful for what you have today. The fifth tip would be share with others. Basically, sharing is caring. When you share what you have with others, it's not only make them happier, but it will also help you to improve your mood. So be there for your friends and family member. So this way, everyone benefit from the love and support including yourself a little bit goes a long way so the sixth tip would be people most often forget about their self when they are busy but it's very important for you to take care of yourself eating on time eating healthy take good care of your body having a healthy lifestyle it will all pay off at the end also it's very important for us to make time just for ourselves so we can recharge our mind also make sure not only just taking time for yourself also giving back any love and support that you can the seventh tip would be learn something new. Every time you learn something new, it's a great way to open up your mind, make you more receptive. It could be learning a new language or learning to play piano or starting an online course. Learning help us grow as people and give back any time we put into effort, so why not? So the eighth tip would be learn to let go. Letting go is a hard thing to do, but it's absolutely necessary. Learning how to let go thoughts, bad memories and let go of people as well so you can live the life the way you want. The ninth tip would be be grateful for all of your accomplishment and the things you have. Basically appreciate what you have. The only way life will be amazing if you decide to take few minutes every day or every week every positive thing in your life no matter how small or how big that alone can make a difference. So the tenth tip would be take care of your emotion. It's very important how we talk to ourselves and respond to ourselves because emotion will lead us down a path that may not be what we want. So positive self-talk, not letting your emotion get the best of you, definitely going to help. You find yourself in a negative place. You have to try to break that cycle. Do something what makes you happy and distract your mind. That will definitely help. So hope this 10 tips was helpful to you. If you have any question, you could always ask me in the comment section. You could check out my channel playlist. You'll find many great videos. And if you give a thumbs up to this video, I will really appreciate it. Take care.